Renata, everyone is okay, but you said the woman fears that this could have been deadly. Yes, and I'm going to tell you why as I show you this hole. Take a look. The entire panel just fell out. Pieces of it are still falling out. Ten minutes before this happened, the woman who lived here was cleaning the floor underneath of it. She tells me it's usually her grandkids who are in this room. She showed me a picture of her grandbaby directly beneath where the ceiling collapsed. Be careful because you never know when, you know, a whole big clump will come back down. There had always been cracks in Miss D. Johnson's friend's apartment, but they never expected this. A loud crash Monday night. Everything just broke. My aunts are dead. I had some of their little things in there. I was just talking when I was here on Saturday with Miss Sally about this crack coming around the light. I said, yeah, I've been noticing new cracks. Misty Johnson is the president of the Northwoods community. She says the older apartments were built in 1959. She and the movers guessed the insulation in the ceiling had seen plenty of those years, too. It's been years, years. Thank you. Flooding hit this apartment and others hard in 2003, but there's no word yet on if that played a role in the ceiling collapse. Misty was told another ceiling caved in last weekend in the neighborhood. Huntsville Housing Authority didn't confirm that, nor did they answer before airtime if they would be inspecting apartments. Do you think they will be checking other ones and taking concerns more seriously? I think they will. I think they will probably have someone to come out and inspect them and make sure that, you know, this is not about to happen to someone else. Still thinking of her friend's grandchildren, a word of warning to others. See to it that your home is fixed. I want to give you another look here at the insulation from the ceiling because they're worried that it could have asbestos. Now, the movers here have about finished up, and the woman who lived here for nine years has just moved down the street. Putting the Valley First live in Huntsville, Renata DiGregorio, WZDX News.